Hello everyone, in today's video I'll be showing you how to paint a moonlit sky surrounded by a whimsical cherry blossom tree. Even though this one is a little bit more technical, it is still pretty easy for those wanting to learn how to paint and get some ideas on what to paint. Make sure you watch until the end to see the end result. If you are new here, hi, welcome, go ahead and subscribe. If you would like to see more from me, click that notification bell to be notified when I upload my next video. Let's get started. Okay, everything I use in the video will be listed in the description below. To start off, I'm going in with a blue in the center of the paper. Now this is going to be a little bit hard for me to explain but hopefully it will make sense in the end. Basically I am working from the centre outwards using the blue going around in a spiral. Apply white to the centre working your way out to create a lighter shade of blue in the centre and having it get slightly darker as you work your way out towards the edges leaving the corners blank just for now. Continue lightening the centre of the paper until you are happy and darkening the outer areas with blue still going around in a spiral. Next apply black for those corners that we left blank and edges until they are covered with black paint. You will hopefully understand why I'm doing this at the end, but now I am adding more white to the center, outwards going in and out and darkening certain areas. Allow the paint to dry, go back into the center with more white paint, spread it outwards, apply more blue.
the center is where I'm going to be placing the moon but for now put a bit of water and white paint on your paintbrush and splatter it onto the paper to create the stars like you can see me doing here place the moon like you see in the video and outline the tree around the moon and fill in the tree trunks and branches with black paint Let the paint dry. If you are new here and have not seen me do this before, grab some cotton tips, swabs, and bunch them together by tying them with a rubber band. Dip them into some white and pink paint and dab them onto the paper to create some cherry blossoms. Here I am using just one cotton tip, adding in singular little dots to make some areas more vibrant and having some blossoms falling off the tree in a whimsical way.
Highlight the tree with a bit of white paint and blend it in with black. To finish off, apply some white paint to the end of a very thin paintbrush and use it to dab onto the paper to create some more stars. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, like or leave a comment. Again, if you are new here, go ahead and subscribe. My next video will be of a child holding an earth balloon. I upload every Friday. Until next time, stay creative. Bye.